Don't we have a meeting? We're in, the, we're in a meeting right now. No, I think we have a meeting meeting with uh, Bruce. Come on, meeting started. Yeah, we have dude, to go to the meeting. Hard. Where's the meeting? The meeting started. The fucking meeting. Uh, I started without you guys. Come I'll on. Go, I'll get meeting. Mimi's not important. Hey, Mama, let's do the fucking meeting. My name isn't Mama, by the way. It didn't matter what Mama's name was. What mattered was that it was 5.50 on a Friday afternoon, and Bruce called us for an urgent meeting. He gave us no details as to what he wanted to talk about, so there were a range of feelings flowing through the team. Yep. No Mommy. one said it was. I'm sorry, you need Come to on, let's get out of here. Come on, meeting. Come on, Moana. Come on, Moana. We're going to be trying not to say that. We would continue to say it. In order for the meeting to take place, we needed Tori, the office gimp. Without him, the meeting would have gone fine, but with him, it was going to be the same. Tori, you come to the meeting? Is the meeting now? Yeah, meeting's right now. Uh, I didn't prepare my notes. That's okay, come on. All right. Come on, Tori. God. Where the fuck is Bruce at? Is that, is that, so no! No! It was a warning. No! In case you do something sued, I will Don't kick the gun. It's not here. my gun. Dude, yeah. Bruce sees us. No! No! Kip is usually a laid-back kind of guy, except when it comes to last-minute meetings. He reacts by lashing out at those he cares about the most, i.e. me. But I knew at least Mama would handle herself professionally. What? Holy shit. Dude, me. Jesus Christ. Did you also just fart? Yes, she also farted. But it didn't give me the best impression that Mimi was drinking so much. Something was clearly wrong. Did she know that Bruce intended to fire us? We couldn't be sure. This isn't Jesus, college. she's downing it. Timmy, it's oh my Whoa, god. Whoa, okay, well. Chug, chug, chug. Work's not over. Very oh genuinely, god. let's, wow. Oh my god. Go, go, this go, isn't, go, this go, isn't, go, this go, isn't, go, go, don't go, go, Jesus go, Christ. Go, Wait, why are you doing that though? Is there a reason? I knew it. I knew we were being fired. I don't know how I knew, but I started feeling this way ever since Bruce left a note on my desk that said, I'm sure whatever venture you take part in next will be successful. I'm so sorry you won't be with the company anymore because we're canceling the channel and firing you. I don't know how I knew, but I did. Damien, quick question. Do you think this is helping or hurting the situation if we are getting fired? Yes. Well, no, no. Hey, well, don't, you know. You if, didn't answer appropriately. If you believe it, don't, don't go ahead and... Well, I don't know what I believe anymore. anymore. That's very inappropriate. Holy shit. What the fuck was she doing? She, when Mimi's been drinking, she's sucking fucking talking fucking feels you up. Um, hey. Hey. You guys need me now? Yeah, yeah. Dude, we need you. Well, you called the meeting. You called the meeting. It's true, I did. What's this meeting about? Classic managerial tactic. Make your employees question the very nature of their existence. I respect that. But I called this meeting... 9-1-1. Because... Autumn and I are having problems in bed. Oh fuck, that's the worst thing I've ever heard in my life. What? Go she, on. she thinks that I'm too small. Uh, if you look close enough on the left over here, I'm I'm throwing up uh, just because of everything and how it is. Like as a whole, like you're I don't understand. Okay, wait a minute. My question: Why the fuck are you telling us this? What can we yeah. do to help? Because I need. Whip your, it out, dude. Let's see. I need your help. Wait, wait, you want to lay it on the table? Whip it out. See, can you hear? Bruce is a big guy, though. I don't know what's, what's no, small. No, no. What would be here. small? No, I think I'm good, Bruce. Autumn, I, I want you to save um, this footage in a little folder I have on my C drive um, that says, in case. Steve, okay. Steve, just Open your me. eyes! Ah! Oh. Is that too small or too big? Ah, pretty good! Hey, I didn't mind it. Hey, Autumn, Autumn, instead of uh, the in-case folder, let's actually put this clip in the memories forever for me one instead. How big are we talking? Like a, a grain of rice? We're talking like bigger than me. Cooked or not cooked? So, it just depends on what Autumn wants, I guess. All right, well, dude, look, look, look. Steve obviously doesn't know how to describe any penis, let alone your penis. So nope. can you just turn around, please, and show us? Don't be ashamed. What? Oh, what? Jesus. Holy shit! Wow. Not bad, not Whoa. bad at all. Why are you how looking for? That? She said, yeah. well, she what? Too small. Yeah, is she said it was too small. Is Autumn the Grand Canyon? Yeah, that's too small. I'm gonna see him bigger. Oh fuck. Who's? I've seen Jamie's penis. It was forgettable. Anyway, it was only possible to fix Bruce's problem by getting Autumn's side of the story. She's not gonna pick this call up either. And just tell her to come to the conference room. Hello. Hello. Hey, can you come into the to uh, Ryan's office? Yeah, one sec. Wow, very uh, formal conversations you guys have. Yeah, very it's formal. It's so been really Autumn, tense between us. So oh. Autumn's, uh, Autumn's dick is too small is the, is the issue here. And Stop if her clitoris is, right is, is, right is extra long, the clit can also be mistaken Shut for a small cock. Right I was actually born with a clit, but the doctors left it on, so I still have it. It looks more like a skin tag now, but instead of a skin tag, it's just a clit. Everybody pile out! Here it is. This is absolutely not a, not a, no. Guys, we have out. We have Check standards and we're not meeting them. I think this is gonna be great. Tori. We left the room to give Autumn and Bruce some privacy. It was important that they were left to their own devices, so we steered clear of interfering. I told 
I told everybody that my dick was too small and you thought my dick was too small. You said that. When did I say that? You said it to me earlier. And I showed, I showed my dick to Steve and he said it was, it was fine. You're fine. Right. Right. Can you, guys, can you back me up? Is yeah. bigger? Yeah, it's no, it's big. huge. It's what does it mean, for God's God. sake? We weren't getting anywhere, so I tried to peer mediate their conversation. Bruce, yes. what's your issue right now? My issue is that she thinks that my penis is too small, but you said it's big enough. Yes, but then Autumn clearly says, it's, where, when did she said, when did I say that? So my yeah, question is, like, what's, what's big enough for Autumn? Yeah. What yeah. size are you looking for if you're not looking for a hunker like that, crook? I don't even know what we're talking about. I really don't even remember saying that to you earlier. Autumn. Okay, come on, Kip, you, you do this instead. This fucking, I can't hear it off music thing. You've seen my precious cock gobbler, and... What? Well, the picture I accidentally sent. Back at our old office, Kib had accidentally texted out a picture of his gonads in string theory. I actually submitted the picture to Rotten.com, but they declined to accept. Same with Lively. And you've seen my nut had been fall through a short. Why did you see his nut in a video? I had been fall through a short. What, you saw his penis and his nut? I've seen you've seen his I've seen cock and ball? You see, it wasn't I've seen sexual. I've seen things. Steve's dick. Silence. Silence. The... Silence. What I think the issue is, is that Autumn's looking for something more, I don't know, cow-like? And yours is more the de de horse. What are you talking about? Horse, horse stick is good horse stick. That's really long vented. That's what I'm saying. And I think we need to come to a, a mutual understanding here that- <laughs> All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. My turn, my turn. Well, you're really gonna need to get used to doing it. Mm. Because the way I see it right now, it's probably a lot of fucking like suck and take or something. I don't suck know. Suck and take, yeah. What you need is a lot of mutual masturbation. Ooh. And the way that you do that is with just any sort of liquid that you can find. <clears throat> I'm talking motor oil. Can we use sriracha? Coolant. James thinks any problem can be solved with mutual masturbation. Well, I disagree. I don't think you can solve any problems. Sriracha mixed with honeydew melon mush. That sounds good. Oh my god, dude. And you, you do, you just lather it up. She does like honeydew. You just lather it up. I think we've been demonetized. No, we you're about to be demonetized when I can your fucking your ass. What do you ass. want, hey, Bruce? Can we see your dick? What do you want? Yeah. What do you want? You I don't even listen to Jamie anymore, okay? Uh, He's fired. This time I'm always getting fired. Hey, Jamie, you want me to take you uh, to exile real quick? Okay, let's go. Okay, Thanks. keep the chip. What are we? Come on. Would you eat the chip finally? Here we go, to exile. Oh, oh no, that's... I'm a full-time producer now. I'm not. I'm I need to get up in there. there. I'm not just a guy. You're really fucking annoying, dude. You know what? The bright side, we're not fired. Yeah, Dude. how about that? Where's this dick no, was right here? I know! Did I've never seen a dick that big. Did you see the vein that went that started at the tip and went into his urethra but came out? What's the biggest dick you've ever seen? Well, I haven't I, 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 I don't even know. Well, you gotta... It, it, well, spit it out, you fucking moron! Hey! What? Do you know where the party's at? You know? There's one of my pants, I think. Uh, I'm gonna head out. I'm gonna head out. Where are you going off to? No, so no, quick? Steve, no, Steve. Come on back. No, no, no. Let's hear about that. Not, not that kind of party. party. You don't want that kind of party. You're almost married. You're almost married. But not quite. Listen, 